Hey guys, what's up? Bisectatron here from Clash of Clans Manual, bringing you guys a short war recap video in 3 Star Union, and a quick announcement first, uh, my main account is hanging out here in 3 Star Union, I'm actually recording on it right now, and the reason for that is I'm undergoing a few queen upgrades, and I cannot war in 49er War Clan without my queen, uh, but I'm going to go ahead and, and do some wars here in my subscriber clan, 3 Star Union. So that's going to be fun. And uh, you guys, for those of you that still want to see the high-level war play, uh, all, that, all those good attacks and stuff in 49er War Clan, I'm still going to visit and uh, do a war recap. I won't be in it, but that doesn't really matter. Uh, I'll still you know, do some war recaps and visit the clan. So you'll still see some of that. But for the most part, the live attacks and stuff will be from this clan. Uh, clan, the live on battle day, uh, all those series, uh, series will be in this clan. So hope you guys enjoyed that. Anyway, though, let's get to the two attacks I'm gonna show. And this war was not that close against a level five clan. They struggled on our top bases and didn't even attack a few of our sevens. Uh, and then we got everything taken care of except a few. I think these are town hall eights got away from us. Um, we're in a bit of a transition period. We have a lot of town hall sevens that just went to Town Hall 8, and that gets us some tough matchups. So hopefully they can get their troops upgraded, and we can start taking care of uh, all of these Town Hall 8s that we face, uh, and 3 starring pretty much all the bases except the top few. Anyway, though, we're going to look at KFS on number 2, and nice attack here, uh, Goho Wee Wee, dropping a few hogs. It's going to take the CC Lure. Uh, he'll drag him down to the bottom here, I believe. We'll fast forward. Yeah, drags him down to the bottom, uh, does some barch to distract, goes ahead and uses the poison, takes out those archers, and he'll slow down the dragon a little bit. Um, he's going to go, go ahead and drop those dragon, or those golems right away, uh, let the dragon just uh, focus on the golem. It doesn't do too much damage to it, and then the queen and some wizards are going to shoot it down pretty quickly. Uh, wizards create in the funnel, then drops his witches. Uh, those are going to spawn some skeletons, help tank. And then a nice jump spell to let everything on into where the queen is. Uh, goes ahead and drops his king. Wait, nice and patient. Make sure everything's, uh, the funnel's created. His king goes right in. He'll take out the enemy queen. Um, everything's focused on the golems and the skeletons. So that's all good. Uh, troops making their way into the core of the base. Uh, distracting all these defenses. And now here come the hogs. He's going to go ahead and drop them uh, while the expos and those teslas are all uh, distracted does catch a giant bomb on the outside of the base, but doesn't do too much damage to his hogs. Uh, they kind of split into two groups here. Um, has three heals. He'll drop one right there in the first group, and then another one on the second group, which losing a few to spring traps. This guy actually had pretty solid spring trap placement, even though his base layout wasn't that great. So you can see a few hogs will continue to go flying every few seconds. But uh, still has the witches in there, spawning skeletons. I think has uh, two of those up, and then some wizards, the queen, and the great thing about this base is he doesn't have that many hogs left, but the queen can basically shoot down every remaining defense. Uh, she can access them all from the core of that base. So she'll help the hogs. Another one goes flying to a spring trap, but she's there. Uh, still has a golemite, some wizards, and not a ton of cleanup troops. Uh, just has a handful of hogs, the queen, wizard, witch, and a few goblins and stuff. But we'll fast forward because has enough time. Uh, had about 15 seconds left, I think. So, uh, Queen really helps with cleanup. Nice job to KFS getting the three star uh, on their number two. I'm right, just going to show one more attack today. A uh, quick war recap. We're looking at Azur Kami taking on their Town Hall 7 here. And just a nice dragon attack. We haven't seen much of um, his attacks because he's been opted out of war for the most part. But comes back here. I, I love the CC lure and then the lightning spell that takes out uh, the wizards and the air defense that's an awesome way to do it we don't see that many um, we don't see that many wizards in the CC it's usually a dragon but uh, worked out here and awesome job just took one barbarian one wizard did make it out alive somehow so goes ahead and brings that over and kill it with some bar uh, barch now it's time for the dragon part of the attack only one air defense left up so goes ahead and creates this funnel with two dragons there that's great uh, textbook stuff there, and then dropping the rest of his dragons, and they're going to path right on into that air defense, uh, so all that's good stuff, uh, it'll take it out real quickly, and it has a dragon uh, in, a, in the CC, a level 3 dragon, so we'll go times 2 as things 
uh, clean themselves up. Dragons, you know, just no real threat at Town Hall 7 besides those air defenses in the CC troops. So if you can deal with them, uh, it's a very easy 3-star. Those Archer Towers, the Teslas, don't do much damage to your Dragons. As long as you have a few of them still up, uh, they'll be fine and they'll be able to take those out. So drops a few Wizards for cleanup. That's all good. Uh, takes the base out really quickly, so nice job. Um, keep it up. Good attack. And that's going to do it for this war recap. Like I said, more videos coming soon. Stay tuned. Uh, most of them from the subscriber clan, but I will uh, go back to 49er War Clan to get some Town Hall 10 and Town Hall 9 gameplay from there. So stay tuned for that if those are the kind of videos you like. Anyway, that's going to do it, though. I'll see you guys later. Bye, Secretron out.